video. So today's topic is exports. So in most of the cooperative exams, you might have seen a question like two to the power. What is a unit place? Or sixteen to the power of eight. What is a unit unit place? If we give the small number, candidates will attempt this question. But now we'll see a question. 6,324 to the power of 1,797 multiplied by 650 to the power of 360, 341 to the power of 786. What he is asking, what is the unit place when we multiply this? Whenever candidates see such questions, they are scared and whenever see, whenever they see, this many bigger numbers. They just skip this question. Why they are skipping this question? I don't know. Because these are the very easiest question and this can be solved within a minute. But before solving this type of question, you need to be knowing certain tricks. What is that certain tricks? We'll see it. 4 to the power of 1 will be 4. I'll write it as 0, 4. In the unit place, we will always 4. 4 to the power of 2 is 16. 4 to the power of 3 is 64. It means that when you multiply, that is 4 to the power of any odd number, the unit digit will be always 4. 4 to the power of any even number, the unit digit will always be a 6. So here, in this problem, we will see, I'll just skip this part, I'll just concentrate on the 4 and the last digit over here. Here, they are saying that 4 to the power of some n, that means 4 to the power of any odd number, the unit digit will be 4. Now, the next, I'll skip this part, I'll consider only 5. 5 to the power of 6. We will see what is the exponents of 5. 5 to the power of 4 is 5. 5 to the power of 2 is 25. 5 to the power of 3 is 125. So that means 5 to the power of any number, the resultant answers unit digit will always be 5. That means 5 to the power of 6, when you multiply them, the unit digit will be 6. So next, coming to 1. 1 to the power of 1 is 1, 1 to the power of 2 is 1, 1 to the power of 3 is 1. So when you multiply 1 by any number, the unit digit will always be 1. That is 1 to the power of 6 is 1. So now I will multiply this unit places. 4 fives are 20, 20 ones are is 20. Therefore, the resultant answers unit digit will be 0. So don't be scared when you see such a bigger number. Only thing that you should remember is tricks how to solve. Thank you for watching.